Good morning, YouTube. How's everybody been over the weekend? Uh, just want to go over a couple of things today. Uh, one is, how do you obtain your CDL? How do I get into a CDL school? What is... Uh, what was the question was? What is the term of the loan? Well, whatever. Thanks for what somebody asked. Well, if if you go to CDL school through a technical college or something like that, it normally is either paid by job service or unemployment service. Uh, they have some kind of fancy name for it. Um, and they send you through school, pay for it, and I think they actually pay you if you don't have a job, uh, they pay you unemployment while you go through the school. Uh, once you obtain your CDL, you look for a company that takes student drivers. Uh, in my area, the number one company right now is GMP that takes student drivers. But there's other companies, uh, much as it's hard to say, uh, CRST. Um, a company out of Tennessee called Skyway uh, is just two right off the bat. Uh, but if you want to um, not go through technical school or if you want to sign on with one of these carriers that offers a CDL paid package um, which they'll bring you into a school They'll test you. That's drug test, CDL test, driving test, put you up in a hotel, which most of the time, like CRST has the dorm rooms. Uh, there's three beds in a room. Um, then they have showers and they feed you breakfast and lunch and supper, I think, uh, while you're in school. Uh, you'll be there with other CRST drivers that are coming in getting training to be lead drivers or they're touching up on some other stuff um, So the conversation about how the company's doing or what the company's going to these drivers can help you But if you sign on you have to stay a certain amount of time To clear your debt with them Only one way two ways really one way is do your time. Once you get some money saved up, then you can buy the contract out and leave if you're in that window um, that you hadn't um, your time. Say you may be there, say that it's six months, you don't work three, and you call up and say, how much is it to buy my contract out? And they tell you, blah, blah, blah. And you got that money saved up, pay it out, and move on if you want to. But other companies, want you to have at least a year's experience uh, before they'll even talk with you. So the best thing is, uh, I know the pay's not gonna be all that great uh, because they have all these sliding scales and stuff like that. Uh, it's just do your year, then move on. Uh, that's what I did. I had to buy my contract out. Uh, it cost me $3,400 or $3,500. Uh, years ago to buy my student contract out but um my employer reimbursed me after 90 days uh yeah that's what happened i'm pretty sure it is um so you know what once you get in that area uh but that's how you obtain your cdl uh Everybody has to drive for a year. Everybody <clears throat> uh, has to take the test, the backing test, this, that, road test. Everybody has to do that in CDL. Uh, can it be a rewarding career? Yes, it can. Uh, can it be away from home six months at a time? Yes, it can. Can you get home every night? Yes, you can. <clears throat> every other night, every three nights, every four nights. Um, 
it just all depends on who you go with and uh, what fits your criteria. Now, some of these companies that over the road six months at a time or whatever, pay a little bit more money, but you can't ever get off. Oh, we don't want to let you off, but you just got to be aware of that. Now, some of the companies you off every other night don't pay as much money, but you're home every other night. Uh, so, you know, you got to see where your level of being on money wise all fits your criteria. Um, but this is a video one um, of how to attain your CDL.